What's up everyone? Welcome back to World Renowned Turbo Tractor for another awesome Disney Cars Diecast video. Today we're going to be taking a look at this awesome Disney Store exclusive Diecast 10 pack that comes with 5 World Grand Prix racers as well as their crew chiefs. The other 5 World Grand Prix racers were also released with their crew chiefs in a similar pack back in the day. This pack was released in 2012 and retailed for $60 in the US and $74.50 over in Canada. In this pack we get Shu Todoroki and his crew chief, Mott Maksuo. We also get Nigel Gearsley and his crew chief, Austin Littleton. We get Raul Sarul and his crew chief, Bruno Mortariu. We also get Lightning McQueen and his crew chief, Mater as well as Carla Veloso and her crew chief, Cruz Besoro. And it is officially called the World Grand Prix Racer and Crew Chiefs Diecast Set. We also get some cool artwork for Lightning McQueen as well as the World Grand Prix logo and the American flag. Around on the side we see Shu Todoroki as well as the Japanese flag, Nigel Gearsley and the British flag, Raul Sarul and the French flag, Carla Veloso and the Brazilian flag, and on the back you can see all of the other World Grand Prix racers that you can get along with their crew chiefs in the other 10 pack. And that's it for the packaging. Let's take these die cast out. As you can see on the bottom here, all these die casts are secured with screws. Here's the French racer Raoul Sarul as well as his crew chief Bruno Mortariu. First of all, here's Raoul. We can see he's this really awesome rally car. He's got a determined expression, blue eyes. Also, a really nice detail is that he's got these plastic inserts for his headlights. As usual, he has his French flag design which has this speckled look to it. Carried on with the blue, the white, and the red. His spoiler has a World Grand Prix logo and also has his sponsored GRC on the hood as well as on the sides here. Plus he's got some really nice silver rims. Around the back we can see he's got this French shield right here and he is number six. Then we can see the French flag as well as World Grand Prix again. And he's also got this really awesome red plastic spoiler attached here to the top. His crew chief, Bruno Mortarillo here, sports the same French colors. His base color is a light blue. Around the back here, he's got this French flag. Also, we can see that he's got this French flag as well as the World Grand Prix logo in the form of a shield right here. He's got an interesting expression. And he's got brown eyes right there. He's got these silver plastic rear view mirrors. And he appears to be some sort of French car such as a Citroen, which is very interesting. Comparing the Disney Store versions to the Mattel versions, I find the main difference is the size. I can see overall, both versions of Raoul are pretty much the same except for their expression. Also, the Mattel version has decals for the headlights instead of plastic inserts that the Disney Store version has. For Bruno though, I notice that the model looks very different, especially in the front end, which is interesting. Also, the Mattel version includes a headset. The Disney Store version doesn't. I believe he appeared with a headset in the movie, his expression is also very different as well. And of course, here's McQueen and his crew chief Mater, two of our favorite characters from the Cars franchise. Taking a closer look at McQueen here, we can see he's got his usual World Grand Prix paint job that he appeared with in Cars 2. He's got the Hudson Hornet Piston Cup logo on the hood here with these awesome flame decals. He's got a very happy expression, his eyes are blue, and he has these very realistic plastic inserts for his headlights. Then around the side, he's got Lightyear tires, red rims, as well as the 95 Lightning Flame logo around on the side here. He's also got this World Grand Prix logo with the American flag and number 95. Around back, we can see the All in All logo as well as the World Grand Prix logo and his taillights. Plus, now he has this awesome World Grand Prix spoiler attached to the back. 
Mater here, first off, we can see has a very jolly expression. His eyes are green and his mouth is wide open, yelling into this headset. This headset is a rather soft plastic that attaches up here and he's got a mouthpiece that extends down to his mouth. He actually doesn't have much of a rust color. He's mostly just brown, but it still does the trick. And he's got this 95 logo since he is part of McQueen's pit crew. And he's got these rusted rims here, signature to Mater. He's got the same logo on the other side. And he's got this towing hook back here, which is a very soft plastic. Comparing the Disney Store versions of McQueen and Mater to the versions that were released by Mattel, we can of course again see the main difference is the size because the Disney Store diecasts are 155th scale, whereas the Mattel diecasts are 164th scale. But we can also see that we have plastic inserts for the headlights on McQueen, though there are decals on the Mattel version. Also, we can see that there's actually a rust textured paint job that is applied to the Mattel version of Mater when it's just brown on the Disney Store version. Also, we can see, strangely, the headset mouthpiece extends on a different side on both of these versions. I wonder which one is accurate. Here is Team Brazil for the World Grand Prix, Carla Veloso and her crew chief, Cruz Besoro. Here, for this Carla Veloso diecast, we can see she has a happy expression with brown eyes. She also has these cool plastic inserts for her headlights. And she has some very vibrant decals going on here, which include some yellow, some blue, and green, which looks very fantastic if I say so myself. She's got blue rims, she's number eight in the World Grand Prix. We can see the World Grand Prix logo as well as all in all here. And she also has a very unique spoiler with the World Grand Prix logo as well. Cruz Besoro is a very small Volkswagen Beetle diecast. You can see that he is dark green in color. He has a very happy expression with brown eyes. We can see his Volkswagen Beetle headlights right here. He's got these silver rear view mirrors on the side. He's got some similar designs here that were seen on Carlo Veloso. Of course, a lot less of them. We can also see he has a World Grand Prix shield with the Brazilian flag right there, as well as silver rims. And of course, here is Disney Store Carla compared to Mattel Carla. And you can see the main difference to be noted is the size and scale. Here we have Shu Todoroki and its crew chief Mak Matsuo from Japan. Shu Todoroki here has a very challenged expression. He's got brown eyes and he's looking off to the side. He too has plastic inserts for his headlights. We can also see the Japanese flag colors here where he has these awesome red flames. His base color is white and he's got some Japanese characters here on the hood. On the side here we can see that he is number seven. World Grand Prix is there as well as all in all and he's got these cool silver rims. He too has a unique World Grand Prix plastic spoiler attached to the back here. Mach Matsuo here appears to be a Datsun 240Z sport car. Just like Shu, he is white and he's also got some looks like dragon or flame red designs coming along here. Love those decals. He also has a happy expression with big brown eyes. And we can see the Japanese flag shield right there as well as his silver rims. His model is very interesting. Once again, here is Shu compared to his Mattel release. We can see not a lot is different except for his scale. Also, the Disney Store has a black antenna right here, whereas the Mattel version doesn't. We can also, of course, again see that he has plastic inserts for his headlights for the Disney Store version, but they are decals on the Mattel version. The Mattel version also has a black painted splitter, whereas the splitter is white for the Disney Store version. Here is British racer Nigel Gearsley along with his crew chief Austin Littleton. We can see 
that he is a British sport car. He appears to be an Aston Martin. He's dark green and he has a very determined expression. He's got brown eyes and he also has plastic inserts for his headlights. He's got these cool little stripes that come along here that are a lighter green. And on the side, we can see that he is number nine from the UK, World Grand Prix and all in all. We can also see he has silver rims like many of the World Grand Prix racers do. Around the back, we can see his tail lights as well as many other logos that were carried from the front. And he's got a unique plastic spoiler that's black and says World Grand Prix. Austin Littleton is in fact a very little die cast, but he has a pretty happy expression. He has brown eyes looking off to the side here. We can see a silver emblem that is on the front there, as well as this grill decal, which is very detailed. He's got a silver bumper. And on the side, again, he's got the shield with a World Grand Prix emblem and the UK flag, as well as this cool neon green stripe coming through here. Like many other models of cars, this one has a rear view mirror only on one side. And he's also got some other details on the back, such as his tail lights. And that's it for this unboxing and review of this Disney Star World Grand Prix Racers and Crew Chief 10 Pack. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for tuning in everyone and I will see you next time.